Hi everyone, happy Wednesday. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020-2021 Panini Prison Basketball Fast Break Edition. I think that just dropped today. Two box random team break number one. One spot gets you two teams. All cards ship, all teams are in. And th these offer the new... I think there's just different parallels here. Yeah, they're, they're your fast break exclusives right there. So, a lot of fun stuff. Big thanks to these, this group of people for getting into it. So, one spot gets you two. So let's, let's double you up like Sir Mix-a-Lot right there. And then all 30 teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Five and a five. Hard 10 for names and teams. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. And 10th and final time. We've got Seth down to David. Seth with that last mo spot mojo star next to your name. That's kind of weird. Not in there. That's 10 times. There's 10 times. Right. Control, -C. Control V. There we go. There's Seth down to David. Five and a five, 10 times for the teams. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And tenth and final time. We got Rockets down to the Nets after ten. All right, here's how it shakes out. Good luck, everybody. Seth with the Rockets. Jeremy, 33, with the Pistons. David with the Pelicans. Uh, and the Mavs. Scott with the Hornets. There you go. David with the Kings. Nice. Dylan with the Pacers. Mike with the Cavs. Kelly with the Bucks. David with the Wizards. Mike with the Raptors. Curtis with the Suns. David with the Grizz. Jeremy 33 got my Lakers. Dylan with the Heat. David with the Knicks and the OKC Thunder. Kelly with the Jazz. Curtis with the T-Wolves. Nice. Seth with the Spurs. Brian with the Celtics. Kevin with the Nuggets. David with the Trailblazers, Kevin with the Clippers, Dylan with the Hawks, Scott with the Magic, Dylan with the Sixers, Brian with the Warriors, David with the Bulls, and the Nets. Let's get all this on one page here. Let's sort this by column B. Let's box these up. Let's center these up. We're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades, and then, uh, then we'll have the break. Stick around. All right, so while people are trading, um, we're going to see which uh, two boxes we're going to do here in this fresh case of fast break. So it's kind of heavy. Left arm still a little sore out of getting Pfizer one of two. So let's try to see which two boxes we're going to do here. See how we're gonna do this. Let's make stacks of four here. So first, and you can see the box on the top camera as well, we're gonna select a die. We'll select that Bellagio die there. We'll go one, two, three, four, five on the dice roll. If I roll a six, we'll just roll again. There's four. One, two, three, four. So let's get rid of these here. We'll leave those back there so it's a little from the fresh same case here. All right, now there's four boxes here, right? So we'll go one, two, three for the top two, four, five, six for the bottom two. And it's two. So one, two, three, and this is four, five, six. We'll save these for next time. And the next two boxes are already up in the uh, in the store, jazbeescasebreaks.com if you want to go and get it. Looks like looks like no trade. So TWC trade window closed. Let's print and rip. Good luck. There you go, the fast break. 
different parallels in here as well. Good luck. There's the final printout right there. Basketball season getting closer and closer to getting to getting done. I think everyone's looking forward to seeing the teams in the playoffs now. That'd be pretty nice. But for today, Bulls are in Cleveland. Cleveland up 120 to 105. It's almost that game's almost over. 14, 15 seconds left. Looks like Pacers are going to beat the Thunder 120 to 116. That's only six seconds left, unless something crazy happens at the end. Three minutes left in the fourth. Suns are up on the Sixers, 107 to 101. That should be an interesting finish. Warriors up 104, 93 on the Wizards. Final score: Raptors beat the Nets, 114 to 103. Kyrie had 28, 11 and 8. Pascal Siakam, 27 points, nine rebounds, and six assists. Yeah, me too, Chris. I'm over the regular season. As a Lakers fan, I want AD to come back healthy. LeBron to come back. Let's get to the playoffs. Let's get the real stuff going. Hawks and Knicks are tied at the half, 69-69. Rockets, Jazz, or Jazz at Rockets starting up. Jazz up 61-43. Pistons at Mavs. Pistons up 42-38. And the Heat and Spurs are tied in the second quarter, 35-35. Grizzlies and Clippers coming up. Nuggets at Blazers. And T-Wolves at Kings coming up. Who do I like out of the East? Let me look at the East. Yeah, Sixers look pretty good. As long as Joel Embiid is healthy, that's a hard team to stop. And I feel like I feel like having Doc Rivers there has kind of put a different spin on that team. It's a little different energy to that team. I feel like the, the Nets haven't... That's got to come up in the playoffs at some point, right? The Nets, those those top three guys, Kyrie, KD, who's injured again, I think, and James Harden, who's also in, they haven't played together very often. So that might be a problem in the playoffs. And the Bucks, don't sleep on the Bucks. So Sixers, Sixers, Bucks, I feel like could be really interesting. There's Xavier Tillman to 125. One of those two teams, I think, comes out of the West. I don't think, and a nice here's a nice. Disco Parallel, Retro, Flashback Edition, Anthony Davis for the Lakers. That'll be for Jeremy 33. I mean, the Nets are pretty scary. They could, they could still put it all together, you know, but I wouldn't be surprised if they were bounced a little bit earlier. And then next year would be really scary. <laughs> that, believe it or not, especially in the playoffs, that chemistry takes a little bit of time. There's Harrison Barnes, so 175. And there's Devontae Graham, fast break autograph for Charlotte. Scott Blackwell with the horns. If we can find his teammate, Scott. Yeah, Sixers is Simmons getting exposed in the playoffs. I think so too, but I feel like Doc Rivers has been playing him in a better spot than Simmons has been in previous years. I think he can still be pretty effective even with his lack of shooting. There's Saban Lee to 175. There's Simmons right there, speaking of Simmons. Zenas Cantor Silver. Um, I think Chris was Chris Lombardo was hoping he wants to finally see a Lakers Celtics final. That'd be pretty nice. I would I would I would definitely like to see that. Alright, see you Mike. Zobi Toppin for the Knicks that'll be for David there's Robert Covington Red to uh, 125 that'll be for Houston that's going to go to uh, Seth nice LeBron right here Trey Jones These LeBrons, Jeremy 33, who has my Lakers, must be, I think these must still be going for like, I think when this first came out, maybe a hundred bucks, a little bit more a pop. 
I think that's kind of settled at around 50, 60 bucks a pop. The silver ones still go for a lot, though. Let's look out for that. This Covington right here. We've got an OB Toppin, the fast break parallel. Well, the, yeah, health is a huge thing for, for, uh, for Embiid. Chris can see him getting hurt in the playoffs. Yeah, that would be, that would be rough. Ooh, and a LeBron James. So you got the AD, Jeremy, and the LeBron James disco parallel of these flashbacks. Nice, and there's former Laker Vita Zubac. There you go, 75 for Kevin Hull. All right, next box. Oh, wow, there's some family rivalry for Drew. His aunt and uncle are from Boston. Dad's from L.A. That's always fun. But, yeah, that's what I think. Sixers and, and, and Nets, I think, will eventually be in the Eastern Conference Final. Of course, the Nets could be in there, too. But Sixers, Bucks, I want to say. Nets could definitely be in the mix. A surprise, yeah. Celtics have, have been really heating up. So Celtics could be a... A, a very interesting surprise. I would love to see the Knicks win a series. That'd be good for the hobby. Hashtag good for the hobby. The Hawks are in the fourth seed. The Hawks are doing... What the Hawks are doing this season is what I thought they were going to do last season. But they're, they're, they're in the mix. They've been quietly at that four seed. Trey Young could just go off. Trey Young could go off and win a series. Julius Randle and the other youngsters can go off win a series. I think the Hornets are still in the mix in that sort of the playoff play-in games. I really wish they had LaMelo. That would have been good for the hobby. In the West, Jazz are cruising in the West. Well, actually, they're not cruising. Phoenix Suns are only a game and a half behind them. That's kind of crazy. I think the Lakers should move up in the standings a little bit once they get LeBron and AD back healthy. They'll catch up. They'll grab a couple spots. I think it should be good. They just need to. They just need to stay off of the out of the the play-in spot. Too much variance there. Imagine if the Knicks eliminate the Nets in the playoff. Knicks fans would be gloating. It's kind of a. It was kind of like when the Celtics or when the Clippers were up three one in that one series, and then lost, and all the all the Lakers fans were just like lols. What happened to our showdown? I don't want, although the Knicks are not exactly where the Lakers are. Uh, there's Jeff Teague for the Atlanta Hawks. Dylan with the ATL. Skylar Mays back there. I do too, Drew. I think Trey Young's a little undervalued in the hobby as well. I think I think you could probably buy there's Lonzo to 125. I think you can buy low on uh, I think you can buy low on Trey Young. And if he ha if he wins or if he has a great playoff series, even in a losing effort, this goes to David and the Pelicans. This Lonzo too, but if he plays well even in a losing effort, that could help. If he if he's the reason why they win a series, right? And they move on around. I don't think they'll move on too much past that. But if they can win a series, that'd be really good for the hobby too. There's that a 175 CJLV for Portland. Emmanuel quickly playing some good basketball. So is Isaiah Stewart. Isaiah Stewart has been a been a great big man for the Pistons. Pistons, I think, within a the Pistons get another draft or two. Quickly going to David and the Knicks, by the way. Pistons is Jeremy thirty three. If the Pistons another good draft, maybe a free agent here and there. Pistons might be a little ahead of schedule before you know it. There's Terrence Davis. 
75. Here's Obi Toppin once again for the Knicks. David Collender. Cole Anthony still has some upside. There's the Terrence Davis for Mike and the Raptors. Chris Paul Silver. There's a Nico Mannion. And a James Weissman for Brian Watford. Rookie Otto for the Golden State Warriors. Warriors come out to play. And the Nico Mannion as well. He's been getting some minutes. There's Westbrook and that flashback look. Jeff Green to 175. Got another Avica Zubac. A Carmelo Anthony at the end. And there you have it. A very quick, fun break. This is the brand new Prism Basketball Fast Break Edition. Two box, random team break number one in the books from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.